But the feeling is that you, you can't leave your house at night. Like, I have a dog, I don't want to go out and walk my dog. Women in Pacific Beach afraid to leave their homes after at least two women were attacked while walking alone. Good evening, I'm Vanessa Van Hefti. Tonight, there is the possibility of a third attack. 10 News reporter Laura Acevedo is live in Pacific Beach and Laura, the attacks happened along a dark stretch of sidewalk. Yeah, Vanessa, and right now the area is very lit, but that's because of our lights. Now I want to show you what it looks like when our photographer turns off those lights. You can see it, it's really dark out here. It's horrible. It's horrible. It really is. It, it really takes away the peace of our neighborhood. A neighborhood in Pacific Beach is on edge after a man attacked at least two women in the exact same spot. We heard the screaming for help. And so immediately my daughter came to tell me. This woman was too afraid to show her face on camera. She heard one of the attacks right in front of her home. I called 911 and the police was really quick, came out. The lady who was attacked had already stopped a car and we came out to a crowd of people actually. Police confirmed two attacks, both in the same spot on Pacific Beach Drive near Cass Street, both between 1030 and 11 at night. One on July 10th when the man pushed a woman, she was able to run away and called for help. She was just really scared. They tried to take her wallet and they, they uh, she was just like in shock almost. On Facebook, several people posted about a third attack Saturday night. Police haven't confirmed that yet, but SDPD says the attacks are concerning and they want women to be aware of their surroundings. This woman isn't going out at night until police catch their suspect. The feeling is that you can't leave your house at night. Like I have a dog, I don't want to go out and walk my dog. Police don't have a very good description of the attacker other than he's a Hispanic male in his mid-20s, about 5'8 to 5'10 and weighs between 160 and 190 pounds. He has no facial hair, but his hair does fall on his face. The man was last seen wearing a light blue shirt, dark shorts and a hat on backwards. Anyone with information is asked to call Crime Stoppers. Reporting live in Pacific Beach, Laura Acevedo, 10 News.